All right, Project Moon Gold family, we're back with another video. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. We got the hits on the channel. The club is absolutely bumping with crypto and Bitcoin right now. Do not send crypto or fiat currency to the bots in the comments below. I will never ask you for fiat or crypto or anything. I will only be giving it away during my giveaways or my live streams. Guys, this video is only for entertainment, not financial advice. I do my own research. I stay up till 5 in the morning. I'm absolutely obsessed with cryptocurrency. You're not playing with Monopoly money. You're playing with hard-earned money. Do your own research. Join the Telegram below. We're growing it at a rapid pace. We'll be doing trade setups. I want to be on the rocket ship with you when you're going to the moon. When we all are making profit, we're all successful as one. Smash the like and subscribe button. Today we're talking about Vericity. And I've tried to record this video 10 times. This is honestly going to be the death of me. Vericity VRA has no market cap and no circulating supply. A per 24 hour trading volume of 12 million. So I'm trying to figure out why we have no market cap and why no circulating supply. I can't really figure it out. But the coin came into true circulation around here. So March 5th on a Friday. And she started getting confident. She walked in the gym. She ditched her Netflix for a bit there. Took some pre-workout and uh, killed all her PR, her personal records in the gym. And now she's at a penny. And now she found support. She got lazy a bit and she just chilled at home a bit. COVID, COVID got her. So, yeah. <laughs> CoinGecko is actually where I find all my consistent coin research, trending coins, up and coming coins, DeFi, NFTs, you name it. You can actually purchase Vericity on KuCoin, Uniswap, Gate.io. I'm trying to figure out why there's no more data for Vericity, but here's the thing. A lot of people are probably holding back, and when that you know, comes into play on CoinGecko or wherever the stats are, people are going to FOMO into this and the price is going to rise. So when people are fearful, that is when you want to FOMO. When people are greedy, that's when you want to hold back, stand on top of the mountain, watch from afar, and laugh because you know you're getting in at a good time and you're going to wait. All right, so Vericity is looking pretty good. Um, however, we're dropping a bit, but we'll get into that in a bit. Let's go on Lunar Crush. Lunar Crush is where I find the top trending coins that are about to take off. The crew is getting the launch pad set up. The rocket has started. The thrusters are going, and hopefully we're going to the moon. Now, when I look at a coin, I look at 68 to a 72. That's when she's going to start taking off. That's when she's getting ready. And that's when she's in the gym working hard, benching hard, squatting hard. Okay, so we got a 59 for Vericity on the Galaxy score. The altcoin rank is a 292 out of 2,000. So I would like to see this get up to a 150, possibly a 100. And then we know the Galaxy score is going to go up a bit more. Volatility. It is really volatile, very, very bearish right now. Market cap, 65 million. Circulating supply, 3 billion. So here's the thing, CoinGecko is not up, updated. But if you go to Lunar Crush, Lunar Crush is definitely updated. So the market cap is 65 mil, and the circulating supply is 3 bill. So I'm not sure why CoinGecko isn't updated. They'll probably update it soon, but that's what we have on Lunar Crush. Actually, let's go to Coin Market Cap because I want to check it out there. This is another site, just like Lunar Crush, where I find top trending coins. Vericity, yeah. So circulating supply three plus billion, and the max is ten billion. And the market cap is 68. So I'm not sure why she's not on CoinGecko, but she skyrocketed around March 1st. That's when she pretty much went went way up. 
All right, so let's look at Vericity and the website here, their .io. Vericity is a protocol and a product layer platform for esports and video entertainment. All right. When you see the trophy on the right side of the video, turn green. Claim these rewards by clicking on the trophy and creating awards via a wallet account. VRA earned by viewing videos is paid out immediately. Vericity's mission is to significantly increase engagement and advertising revenues for video publishers on any platform. I feel like that would be great for people who do YouTube, like I said, Twitch. VRA rewards product layers integrated for the following video players, YouTube, Twitch, Vimeo. I'm definitely going to get into Vericity 100%. So Vericity is looking good. It's on investing.com, Cointelegraph, a couple of other good ones there, right? VRA Virtuous Cycle. Buyers buy VRA. Game developers, influencers, publishers, sponsors buy VRA with credit cards exchanges to fund their tournaments or campaigns. Percentage from tournaments, campaigns, and ads are earned. Vericity earns. Okay. Influencers, game players, and viewers earn VRA gaming or watching content ads. Game developers, influencers, publishers, sponsors get revenues from percentage of tournaments, campaigns, or ads. Use VRA to subscribe entry fees to games, tournaments, apps, stake, and earn off-ramp or exchanges. Perfect. And then the cycle repeats. Guys, I love Vericity. Let's look at this roadmap. We are in 2021, Q1. Lot of stuff happening here. Q3, eSports, Fight Club, players matching, direct communication, channel between teams and admins, EFC map, notifications for Vera Wallet, VRA digital purchases for gaming hardware enabled partnerships. Q4, NFTs. Guys, Vera City is going to blow up. This is not financial advice. This is only entertainment. Vericity sleeping right now. Don't sleep on Vericity, my personal opinion only. Perfect. I like Vericity a lot. VRA protocol and product layer platform for esports and video entertainment. That's their Twitter. EA e, or sorry, ES Sports Fight Club. Vericity is going to be launching NFTs. Okay. That's looking pretty good. Anything else here? Tokens that significantly outperformed BTC in March. Really? Okay, Audius. Omi. Vericity. Vericity is like the number three. Dego. Yeah. Audius. Vericity. Dent. Vericity is the number three. That is that is pretty big for sure. Vericity is going to pick up a lot of traction, guys, for sure. A lot of traction. This is a definitely a good project to get into, not financial advice. Let's look on CoinMarketCal. VRA. All right, so VRA on CoinMarketCal. We have March 31st viewing VRA reward system. EFC video player release of proprietary EFC video player during Q1 of 2021. Yeah, Vericity has a lot going on, guys. Vericity is going to be very, very successful. If she can follow the roadmap and continue to follow her plan and her goal setting, I think Vericity is a top contender in 2021. Absolutely, I do. Now let's go to trading view because I forgot to pull it up again. Sorry about that. I'm on audio right now because I'm very bullish for Audius. VRA, VRA, there we go, VRA. Okay, so VRA, I did chart this out. I believe so, yep, I did chart it out, perfect. Perfect. So VRA, there's a resistance right here, but uh, this is paper trading, not financial advice, only entertainment. Vericity is a really, really great project, guys. 
If you're looking at projects, you want to look at what is big. Esports is a billion dollar industry. And if they can get some partnerships with uh, product companies like Asus, MSI, you know, big gaming hardware products, like I think they did announce there that they're doing a product partnership, definitely going to get bigger. So entry point for Vera City would be about here. But honestly, it is only at a penny right now. She's consolidating. She's doing her daily routines, but she's not focusing on the gym too much. She's going here and there, and she's pulling back. So we've got the resistance. She broke through. She came back down. If she would have broke through again, that would have invalidated the resistance line. Here's our resistance point. If she comes up and breaks through, she's going up from there. Now this is on a one hour time frame. So we're looking at a five cent call. So in the short term, Vericity is gonna go up to five cents. If you're already in Vericity, where would you take profit? Honestly, guys, I'm not taking profit. I'm hodling until we're getting to about here. Vericity is a really, really great project. But I guess if you wanna take profit, I would take profit pretty much in the middle. So around three cents USD, I would take profit there. But again, I'm not selling Vericity, my personal opinion, not financial advice. I'm hodling it just because it is a really great project. I can't stress that enough. If we break through here again, we'll definitely go up though. She breaks through, comes back down, breaks through, or she could bounce off and go right back down to the support. And this would be a great, great place to buy. But even here isn't a bad place to buy because we're still at a penny. Awesome, guys. Smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. We got the hips on the channel. The club is bumping. It continues to bump. We're not shutting down. There's no closing at 2 a.m. on this channel. We keep going. Do not send crypto or fiat currency to the comments below the bots. I will never ask for it. Be patient when you're trading. This video is not financial advice, only entertainment. Do your own research. You're not playing with Monopoly money. I stay up till 5 a.m. in the morning. I'm absolutely obsessed with cryptocurrency. Join the Telegram, Project Moon Gold. Guys, be patient when you're trading. Take your emotions out of it. With patience comes growth, ultimately bringing you profit. Let's make profit as a community. If we do that, we're successful as one. Have a great day.